Hey, welcome back to another video, guys. You're watching x 2660 with your bro, Zach, here. We're playing Resident Evil 1, Part 4. And now let's just sit back and enjoy. Now we left off last time. We left off getting the blue orb. And the wind crest. And now we're going to see where those go. Oh, oh wait. The, I remember the blue orb went with a tiger. And now I didn't find out where the wind crest goes. Where we got the wind crest, I'm pretty sure. Start by checking over in this blue doors, in the blue double doors. It was on open door, so probably have to go this way then. Well, sounds like we're outside. Whoa. Well, I see a dog right there. So I Die dog. There we
Okay, that barely healed me at all. Rusty boiler, nothing strange. Oh no, I know what this is. It's bringing me for a boss battle. There's giving me six green herbs before I find a boss. Well, that's probably what it is. Then again, I'll pray towards the end of the game, like the last like two or three videos, it was prepping me for a boss too, and there ended up being no boss. So I don't know what I was being really prepped for. But a game like Resident Evil uh, probably has a boss. Stupid dog, get on the way. sure what that room was even for. I guess we'll continue through these double doors and we'll find out where the wind crest goes. That's just a save room. Way another room that's unexplored. It's always good when that happens because it usually means that we're on the right track. So. I 
all those herbs like they were like they did they just try to get into me but they, you're actually more close to you you're on an item slot so. what's this pocket eye Curious. There was a pocket knife, a typewriter, purse, toilet paper hybrid thing, and a lighter. Is it a working lighter? Well, the world may never know, but it was a of course there's a carving of a helmet. My house doesn't have any carvings of helmets on the walls or the doors, I mean. Plus, like they say, work it out, you just punch it out, or shoot it out, I guess. Sure, that door has a carving of a helmet on it, but honestly, a bazooka wouldn't be any match for that. Or would, that wall, that door wouldn't be any match with against a bazooka. You just shoot it, and it would just blow it off, blow it away. But again, it's pretty, like, weak bazooka, though. You shoot it in a mansion, and all it does is explode one dog, or one zombie. Oh wait, you can't call them that. 
games like this. I don't even know what they call them in this game. Down to put everything we worked so hard for down. I put the ink ribbons down, I guess. Considering they transfer the items transfer across weapon stash, I think. So if I want to come back, if I want to save, I just go to the weapon stash and use ink ribbon. games. Because nowadays a game, uh, usually a game is like 20 hours. But I played Silent Hill, bef Silent Hill 1 before for a PS1 and I beat it in like 8 hours. I think this was the door. We'll go this way. No, of 
carving of a helmet, of course. Oh, what's this? Wood is put in the stove. A paper is on the wall. It sounds like a job for the lighter. Oh, actually, light the. Oh, oh, well, that's creative. I don't know. Now I can't read it anymore. Like I was able to read it in the first place. What language is this? Like English. Oh, it's a map on the second floor. Same layout. <sighs> well, we cleared this area out of the way, so now oh, we're pushed back to square one almost. Now we need to find out what the wind crest still does. be too thorough, I guess. I mean, maybe something in here will have something I could put the wind crest into, but you never know. anywhere in here. This just leads back to the hallway, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Oh, okay. Now we'll head back down the stairs and... Hmm. Oh, that's a tough one. I don't really know what to do next. So many doors over here. I don't really even know where to go. Yeah, I'm not going to suit a place with the stupid bats. that one door. When the sun sets in the west and the moon rises in the east, stars will begin to appear in the sky and wind will blow towards the ground. Then the gate of new life will open. It's like some dirty game of charades. Yeah, like with the wind press here, right? Exactly. That's how it's done. Oh, that doesn't help. There's still like three other slots to put stuff in. Locked a carving on a helmet, of course. Uh, we'll go through the double doors then. Oh, we 
knock that portion of the mansion out of the way. Stay tuned for more Resident Evil 1 videos and Sancho 2 videos. Smash that subscribe button and ring that bell. And thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.